Hello, I'm Casey Robertson with Motorsportsland, and I'm here to show you the new Surveyor from Forest River. I'm really excited that we brought Surveyor back. These guys make an incredible trailer. I mean, you look at it and it probably looks like every other trailer out there, but there's really some great features that you can't see, but I'm gonna show them to you. The first thing I wanna tell you about is the material that they use for the outside wall. It's a material called Asdel. It's not a Luon board like most others use and then spray it with a fiberglass chopper gun. No, this material is a composite material, um, so there's no wood on the outside of the trailer. Also, it helps with the insulation. It adds two R values to your insulation, so this makes it a nice insulated trailer. And then it's easy to clean up, is less likely to delaminate on you and things that and other problems that we have with uh, uh, fiberglass trailers like this. So I really like the Asdel material, but it's hard to see when it's all painted over like this. Uh, they put three steps going into your bedroom, as well as the really nice more ride steps that go right down to the ground so they're safe and secure to your main entrance. And they put a nice little light where it should be to shine on the stairs to make it easy to climb in and out of at night. We have a fully automatic awning. We have outside speakers, LED lighting, 100% all the way around. I really like the storage in these as well. You got a huge baggage door storage compartment so you can get big things in there like coolers and stuff like that. Also, all Surveyor tra trailers are pet friendly, which is a lot of fun. They've given you some neat little features for your pets. They have a spot to keep the water and food dish. They have a nice little spot that you can attach the leash. And there's a really cute feature inside I'm going to show you later. Uh, the Surveyor front here, it's all aluminum framing. That's another thing about Surveyor. You have a fully caged aluminum frame trailer here, but their front cap is three quarters inch thick. It's not a half inch thick, so it is solid. Frameless window up front makes it really nice. You got Electric tongue jack. Another big storage door. A lot of trailer manufacturers, for some reason, they'll give you a big door and then a little door on the other side. I like that you get two big giant doors for your storage. Great slide mechanism. Rack and pinion, very durable, uh, easy to get in and out. And around the back, They've conveniently located your appliances in one location, your furnace, your water heater. Uh, they've used the really nice furnace that has this outside cover. And you may ask, what's the difference? A lot of trailers, you'll see just this silver piece mounted on the side of the trailer. And what that means is if you ever need to do maintenance on your furnace, uh, then you have to do it from the inside of the trailer. So you've got to tear your cabinets apart. You've got to get the inside of the trailer dirtied up with the furnace stuff. Uh, with this style, you can just take these four screws out, slide this furnace out this way, do the service work out here. It's a great feature. They got a really nice fold up rack that you can use for firewood generators, but it's got a nice little uh, anchor points here for bikes if you want to use it. All surveyors are have a walk on roof. So you got a ladder going up there, so you can walk on there no problem. You got 16 inch on center aluminum trusses. But what's really amazing about the Surveyor roof is the new PVC material they're using. This is an extreme PVC material. This is so much nicer than rubber or TPO. Uh, it gives you a 15 year warranty on it. There's no maintenance, no treatments you gotta do to it. And it's not textured, so it's not gonna collect dirt and leave streaks down your trailer right after you wash your trailer. Um, like I said, it's 15-year warranty, 
really nice. It also helps keep the trailer cool inside. It's got better reflective properties than TPO or rubber. So when it's 100 degrees down in Southern Utah, it's gonna be easy to keep the trailer nice and cool inside. The surveyors are also a four season trailer. They come with a really, really nice Arctic package. Not only is your underbelly enclosed and heated, but it's also got tank heaters on it. And the insulation in the floor is block foam insulation as well, just like in your sidewalls. A lot of trailers use block foam in the sidewalls, but then use regular batten insulation in the floor. Surveyor takes it one step further and does the block foam insulation in the floor. The secure steps are great. Very easy to get in and out of the trailer. The Surveyor 251 RKS, this is the rear kitchen model. Uh, one thing that's really nice about Surveyor, the roofs, these are almost seven feet tall. You got so much room in this small 25 foot trailer. First, at the galley kitchen, <laughs> They're using the new Furion stove. Furion stove is really nice because you get lighted dials, you get a light inside the oven. It's got this nice glass top, so you got more counter space. Folds over for an, for an extra backsplash. And then you got the nice three burners, and these burners have electric igniters. Don't need a light, don't need a barbecue lighter anymore on this. I also like that Surveyor gave you a nice place to store your cutlery back there. And then they also give you a great pots and pans storage drawer here. And I thought it was neat that they made the drawer face match the oven. Give it a nice clean look. There's lots of storage in this kitchen area. And the cabinets in these Surveyors are screwed and glued together. They are built really, really heavy duty. There's not too many cabinets in the RV world that you can grab, tug, hang from. I mean, these are strong, super strong cabinets. I really like that. Countertop, seamless. It's not a laminated countertop. There's no tea molding, no formica, solid surface, super easy to clean. They've given you a nice, big barn sink with the high-rise sprayer faucet and I like the strainer drain on the sink covers. This model has a nice U-shape dinette and then some more little key features that Surveyor does is fully extended drawers with roller guides on the back and still brackets holding this in place so they don't break and come off track on you. They're really nice. And over on the other side of the trailer, Surveyor is using the new platinum furniture. Um, this hide-a-bed is so easy to make. I mean, everybody's used to a regular hide-a-bed where you got to pull that big frame out and then you got to sleep with the crossbar on you or the trifold sofa where folding everything over. This is so easy, the little kids can do this. Bam, that is your bed. It is a neat, neat way of doing it. Then just give it a little lift right here in the center, slide it in. I think that's the easiest sofa sleeper I have seen in a travel trailer. Now you got great overhead cabinets over here. Again, screwed and glued together, nice and strong. MCD roller shades. I love these shades. They just they don't give you any hassles or problems. They work really nice and easy. Got a great Closet slash pantry with adjustable shelves. A couple drawers down there as well. Big screen TV, nice Bluetooth 
sound bar, and of course fireplace. The fireplace gives you electric heat, which is nice. And right by your entertainment center, a couple USB chargers for your devices. Now let's step forward, go through the bathroom and into the bedroom. Big bathroom, lots of storage. I like that they did a different cabinet color just to set it off a little differently. Uh, big medicine cabinet. And then over on this side, above the toilet, you got a huge closet and linen storage. Should also note how well these cabinets are made. They use the nice spring-loaded hidden hinges on these cabinets so they stay closed when you're on the road. They also use the really nice corner shower. Corner showers are nice because they give you lots of room. Move around in and again, the height of the trailer is really nice with the seven foot tall ceilings because I'm six foot tall and I got plenty of room inside this shower. Up into the bedroom have a nice pocket door for privacy. Beautiful bedroom. Lots of storage. I think Surveyor has outdone themselves on the storage in the bedroom. You got nice big closets, drawers, but you've also got nice little stash spots by your bed, nightstands I guess, with a shelf above them and a cup holder and a drink holder. So you put your drink there before you go to bed or your coffee in the morning and not have it spill on you. The, the other thing I love about these new surveyors is you get a full length queen size mattress that you don't, most of your trailers just come with a RV queen they call them and it's six inches shorter than your normal queen. This is a regular household queen size mattress so all your bedding will fit on this no problem. The window is really neat in these trailers. I call it the stargazer window. It's that front window and that front cap. But the neat part about it is when you climb into bed at night, you can just stare right up at the stars right before you go to bed. Really a nice trailer. Or you can have some privacy. Same closet on this side. Plus your overhead storage, deep. Lots of room for stuff. And I told you, and I told you I was going to show you one more really fun pet friendly feature that Surveyor has added to their trailers. And it's the little bedroom for your dog or your cat or your iguana. And that is the Surveyor 251 RKS. Very nice trailer. We got a full lineup of surveyors down here at Motorsportsland. Be sure to come down and check them out. Thanks. <laughs>